Good day everyone. Turn on these window security settings which will enhance the security and it will make sure that your computer and the devices which are connected to your computer are absolutely safe and secure. So I'll open the window security from the bottom right corner where you will have the shield icon. I'll just do a double click on that. Once it is opened, please make sure security at a glance. The virus and threat protection under Windows Security. Everything should have a check mark, a green check mark. That means no action needed and everything is fine. Now the most important part which I wanted to share is the device security and which is the third, fourth, sixth option from the bottom and you will also find it security at the glance so i'll go to device and security and there is a core isolation helps keep your device safe by protecting the windows kernel so i'll click on that and please make sure memory integrity prevents attack from inserting malicious code into high security process so please make sure in windows security it is turned on and scroll down and check microsoft vulnerable driver block list is turned on or not it is automatically on please make sure it is on and you are good to go and once you go to the home section there is one more thing which you can do is go to the protection history see what exactly uh, has happened any recent action has been taken or not and go to the device performance see the health report and make sure it is up to date you can go to the virus and threat protection scroll down and you will find virus and threat protection updates so if you do not have update you can simply click on protection update and click on check for updates this is a very good thing you can do it on a weekly basis you can come here and check for manually check for updates though it does automatically but I would recommend to check it on your own. Right. And you can also do the Windows updates if you do that. Once the checking is done, once it is done, you can restart the computer. All right. So if you find this tutorial helpful, please hit the like and subscribe. And do let me know in the comment section if you have any query or concern or any kind of issues. I'll try my best to fix your problem. I'll see you in the next tutorial. Have a wonderful day. Take care.